Good afternoon, everybody. This is the single most resilient and bravest person I have ever met in my life. So reporting in from Arizona, I was here yesterday with a couple of senators, uh, attending four public events, everything from a Mormon church to somewhere where a sort of tavern way out in the desert. The globalist forces against Donald Trump means he has to win this election. He needs to win this election. And not just, this is not just about who leads the USA. It is bigger and more fundamental than that. It's about who leads the free world. Uh, what I can tell you, uh, whilst this is one of those states that the Republicans absolutely have to win, and there's been big demographic change, and there's been, there's been talk that Biden could take it. All I can tell you is the level of enthusiasm for Trump is absolutely off the charts. It's almost like a religious fervor. We're proud of our nations. We won't surrender power again to global institutions. We want free speech. We want liberty. We should be able to say things that other people don't like. It's called freedom. It's what we're fighting for. We're here today, a good year, um, in Arizona. Trump will be here soon. He's currently speaking just down the road. I mean, the guy's a human dynamo. I got this right four years ago when I said Trump would win. Believe you me, he's got every chance. Thank you, Nigel. That's something. Wow, thank you. I'm glad I called him up. I'm glad I got